Hey friends, it's April Holly Smith, and you found the channel where we learn to grocery shop together what's on sale, what's not on sale, what's a deal and what's not a deal, and why. So right now, it's time to shop. Okay guys, before we get started, um, it's time to hit the like button because you know that you like grocery shopping and don't forget to subscribe because we do this every week. So look who is here with me. No. Oh man, it's grocery shopping with the grandma. It is a special grocery shopping day. I don't normally grocery shop today, but as we all know, my Aldi's is back open again. And on that occasion, there is a special magical thing a unicorn that must be found the Aldi's coupon so has a coupon that expired today and I was like well hey it looks like this. it looks like it looks just like this except this one doesn't expire today no, so later oddly there is zero standardization with these Aldi's coupons because we had one in the ad which is good till the 23rd and then we had one in a in a flat mailer like a like a cardstock mailer and um she got one that expired today mine doesn't expire today um i got some by the 21st and yeah so that's totally actually, weird so in fact i am future april holly smith and this is future grandma we have already been in and shopped but this is the intro and I'm gonna share this with you. So somebody inside the store who will remain nameless because we don't want anyone to get in trouble for anything, but another shopper. Dang, I thought that car was gonna hit that car. Oh man, that would have been like pretty interesting. Yeah, it was interesting. Exciting times at the grocery store. Anyway, so while we were in the store, another person approached us and um, gave us a coupon that expired today to use today so we could keep our coupon that didn't expire today later. So um, my plan today is to go in and get diapers, which I need, and Halloween candy. Things I don't buy every week. Yeah. And we did in fact use that coupon that expired today so that we could keep our coupon that expires later. later. And then also in the process of shopping, we got two other coupons that do not expire. It's the, where the, the, they expire even farther out. Hi. Hey, friend. Thank you. So, let's check out the milk and egg prices here at Aldi's and move forward with the shopping for this week. The eggs are looking like. Who recognizes Grandma there? All right, so it looks like our eggs are 75 cents, and our bread is, our milk is holding steady at $1.89. How's the eggs look? See, would you see the sign? Uh, I'll take one. So this is part one of my haul, which we were just with future April, uh, Holly Smith, and this is what we got at all these because Remember, my mom had a coupon that expired today, and we had a very generous person swap out the coupons we had that expire later for coupons that expire today that had to be used. So this is what I have. Um, nothing terribly exciting. I did spend $34.19 uh, with my coupon right here. So I got my $5 off. So we got diapers, which actually I needed. I should have got last week, and I realized I only had like four days worth of diapers, um, which I could have made it, I guess, but I know I needed this. So this was $10.99, $11. So that, and that's pretty standard. We got eggs, 75 cents, you know, we can always use eggs. I got two breads, which was 83 cents, and there was some kind of shortage because people were freaking out about how much bread there was not. I know I was on the last bottom tray and it was half gone. So, and then the other thing that I got that I don't candy. normally get. Yes, and why do we get this candy? Go big, go big. 
for trick or treat. That's right. So uh, I did get the good coin. Um, and again, this was the most expensive thing, $14.69. Uh, this is 240 pieces, and I have two trunk or treats scheduled. I have one at church, one at Girl Scouts, and then obviously I'm going to be giving some out of my house. So this isn't the only one that I got, but that's I just needed to get to my $30 threshold, so probably none of this I should have got. I should have got this. And, well, this would have been 15 35 Yeah, I should have just got these two things. And then I got these umbrellas because, and that one's yours. Yeah, that happened. So they were $5 each. They are just obsessed with the umbrellas. So that's where we're at right now. And I'm just going to tell you this week's haul is going to be a little weird because coupons. I have a lot of coupons between now and the 31st. So I have three coupons. That's 90 bucks. We're going to see how things go. Maybe I'm going to skip. I don't know a week or something but we'll see how it goes hey friends it's way in the future April Holly Smith and I know you just watched my haul and you saw like nothing <laughs> and the reason that that happened is uh, when I did my ads this last week I gave you all kind of a good talking to about how there was nothing good on sale and the reason for that is the Super Bowl of food sales are coming up starting about the second week of November and they're gonna go all the way through New Year and you know what I did when I was going in I was like oh I got my my coupon I need to do $30 which I got and I was gonna go in for another round and then I was like there's just not really much that I want here so here's the thing I'm taking my own advice I'm cleaning out my pantry this week so I thought that I was going to go again, but I never went to the store, never bought another thing this week. So next week, I do have two Aldi's coupons. Are you choking? Okay, good. Nobody's choking, just I'm for the just record. I'm just coughing because I have to cough. Okay, so I got two coupons to use next week, so I'm going to do it in two sweeps for sure. Probably not going to have any trouble doing that. So all that Yammer and I did in the ads... I took my own advice, and that that haul you just saw is what it looked like. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you later.